on the 70th anniversary of the Nakba crime. This is Greetings of Solid Humanized Determination, this May 15th, 2018. We are the Tanweer Palestinian Cultural Enlightenment Forum in Nablus. Here in Palestine every day is Nakba Day because of Zionist Israel aggressive war supported by imperialism on the Palestinian people continues every day of our lives since the Balfour Declaration and its British colonization of Palestine in 1917. You should tell all the world that the Nakba, begun in 1947, continues to this day and every day. The Zionist Israel colonies, called settlements, continue to grow only on the Palestinians' private lands next to the villages. Here, close to Nablus, the Zionist colony of Yitzhar has less than 2,000 members but holds captive the villages of 25,000 Palestinians who continue to live in the villages of Urif, Madama, Asira, Al Kabliya, Kufr Khalil, and Burin. Next to the villages of Kufr Kadum, Haja, and El Funduk, Zionist Israel's illegal colony of Kadumim takes over the farmlands of the villagers piece by piece. In Al Khalil, Habon, it is the same from inside. That is the only peace that the Zionist Israel is seeking, and yet the UN Security Council has failed to send to Palestine the temporary international peacekeeping forces necessary to protect the Palestinian indigenous people of this land until Israel's occupation with its military forces and all its colonies withdraw from Palestine land and the Palestinian people attain their independent state on the border of June 4th, 1967. Briefly, apartheid Israel, supported by imperialism, increased the number of Zionists from about 55,000 to 650,000 in 30 years, over the years 1918 to 1948. In addition, it increased their possession of the Palestinian land during the same period from 1.5% to 78%. Also, it deported more than 800,000 Palestinians from their own homes. During its aggressive war in 1967 until now, it occupied the rest of Palestine, West Bank and Gaza Strip, and deported about half a million Palestinians in addition to confiscating more than 70% of the Palestinian-occupied territory. The UN issues nothing but tons of printed paper while we are losing thousands of years of history and work because of the absolute support the U.S. administration gives to Zionist Israel. We welcome your worldwide solidarity until this day will be our day of liberation and our Palestinian refugees return, return to their own homes from which they were deported more than 70 years ago by Zionist Israel, supported first by the UK and then followed now by the USA. The 70% of Gaza who are refugees demand the right of return and we join them from the West Bank to say free, free Palestine.